it's Saturday again. I still haven't uploaded the vlog from last Saturday. Um, but I've been editing it. But I'm out and about today. I'm gonna try to get some footage. I got a few things I need to do. Um, I need to go and get my oil changed. I need to go to the car wash. Um, again, every time I get my car washed, the, somebody's blowing a duster, a blower, you know, like when they cut the grass and stuff. So it happens everywhere. I need to go to the beauty supply store to get some things to do my hair because the puff is back. Um, so, I mean, puff is the hard, hard time, uh, bad hair day thing. So, need to get some things to do my hair. Um, what else do I need to do? I need to go to some stores. I've already been to stores. I feel like I've been in stores all this week since last week. We had a couple of baby showers. Part of my last week's vlog is the baby shower vlog. Um, birthday party. We've already done quite a few things. Um, Taylor came to visit, so she made us breakfast this morning. Um, blueberry muffins like the uh, Sanford and Son episode when the cousin comes to visit and she promised she's gonna make them some blueberry pancakes. <laughs> I didn't think it was really gonna happen, but she made them. So that was delightful. And really, I need to prepare for tomorrow. So um, I've been a little bit tired. I've been tired since last Friday. Um, all I wanted to do was rest last Friday, but we had a lot going on. Um, so I'm not going to do too much. I mean, I cleaned my house some this morning. I should have been vlogging. We had a great morning, lots of laughter. And uh, Pickle is here. So Pickle is a hoot. She's going through some things right now. She's overweight. So we're going to eat something in a little while. <laughs> not no spaghetti. That's why she's fat now. She looks. Taylor's trying to get her weight under control she has a lot of allergies this time of year and just things all the things that come with having a pit bull you know they just come with their own things so um i'll get some footage and hopefully i'll get this vlog um edited and uploaded and and i'll talk to y'all later Thank you. No problem. It's beautiful. That's the place down here. Yes. Oh my gosh. It is beautiful. Wow. I love that's you know, that's my color. They better have it. Everything I love, they eventually stop carrying. Let me come back because I'm into my mind. So the lights went out in the beauty supply and we all have to get out. I had just located the hair after almost <laughs> after almost being paranoid that I wasn't going to be able to find the hair I located it and the lights went out so my husband was asking me if the beauty supply down the street has it because I've gone there since they opened up like almost well it's been 28 years ago um, my daughter was too um, but his lights will be out too I mean it's directly down the street like directly down the street. I don't know. I guess we sit here and wait for a minute. Right here. Okay, the lights are back on. 
Thank you. I'm going to go straight to this hair. Because I know what I need. Let me see. Found it. Because they had put a wall right here. This is it. So the lady in the store gave Reb this key ring because he was looking at it and for us waiting. And he said we find favor everywhere we go. Okay. So, yeah, well, it's, it's a little thing. So while I was in Family Dollar, um, someone came and gave Reb a check. Family Dollar is right down the street from a business that we have recommended people to. And they gave us a check for a full fee. a great experience I have you know a few photographs of my own um, of them in my house I just like um, collecting some of their you know items and stuff so this was a cute wall for me this also was another very cute wall it shows you know Cadillac from kind of the beginning um, to where we are now and it has always been a classic car. It's always been a smooth ride in Texas. We love Cadillac. Um, I've had them since I was 18 years old. I think I've had about five or six now. Um, we still have an old school one. So Cadillac is also known for their service. Like they just treat you really well when you go in. Um, they treat you like you are the priority and your business is the priority as every business should do. I mean, that's part of your branding, um, what you're known for. Um, they always give you curbside service. They'll come and pick your car up. They'll come and okay. drop it off to you. Um, All right. So that's one thank of the great you. Oh, thank you. Yes, so, ma'am. All right. You too. Thank yeah. you. All right. We're ready to roll. So this is it guys, this has been part one of the Saturday vlog. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys soon.